Can I not have sex with you? Is that an invitation? I finally meet Mr. Wright and what do I do? I send him overseas. It's just all about Justin, isn't it? There is nothing between me and Justin. How long are you perving? It's not my fault. That him? Yeah. Good kid. Funny thing is, I'm scared of a five-year-old. Forever is a long time to spend with someone you hardly know. I don't want you to be my last hurrah. Don't? I think you want more than that. So do I. I used to think if you brought all the elements of your life into balance, you could attain perfect happiness. So gorgeous. I have to go. Hey, Luz, I don't want to push you or anything, but this whole fiance thing, what's going to happen then? I mean, you're getting married in a couple of weeks. I know. I'll see you later. Sometimes you can feel that a moment's coming when you have to make a defining choice. Either it'll lift you towards perfect happiness, or spiral you down towards despair. What if your choice plunges someone else into despair? Does that mean your happiness is tainted? Hi, Piers, it's me. Just thinking about you. It's not long now. No. Actually, yes. I don't want to get married, Piers. And now, and this is very exciting, Mr Mark Cannell is here to announce the prize for best head in show. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr Mark Cannell! <laughs> Hi all, this is so exciting, you know, for me and for you, because I have the great pleasure of announcing as grand prize for this show that I will be providing to the winning apprentice a trip to London with accommodation and a six-month traineeship at my hair academy in Knightsbridge. I have to win that. Yes, where all my What? You hate my canal. Yes, but I love London. And all the rest go, so get out there, go practice, because it's worth it. Think of how much I could learn in six months. Think about how much I could teach those English boys in one night. Jeff. May the best head win. Get 
this is just dry ice. I'm gonna pop a bit in and it'll be smoking. No, I don't think it's just nerves, but thanks for asking. Thank you. So, what's it gonna be? The Tuscan lamb or the chicken shiitake? Put us out of our misery. Oh, God. Piers is wearing the pale blue suit. Maybe I should call him. I've got something to tell you, too. Oh, it's the Tuscan lamb. I knew it. Something serious. I'm not getting married. I've cancelled the wedding. I'm not with Piers, either. I mean, I'm with someone else. I'm with Stu. Oh. Oh, this is the happiest day of my life. Does Piers know? Yeah. I told him this morning. And? A bit shocked. I bet. And you've been fucking Stu on the side. Oh, you are a dark horse, Lucy. This is the best news. I've been dreading your wedding. Nikki, don't say something you might regret. What? Well, this might be nerves. Fear. Are you sure, Liz? Yeah, I'm sure. I realise that I've been sleeping with Stu whilst planning a wedding to a man that I've seen twice in six months. Who's a complete prat? Nikki, you'll be sorry. What? <sighs> no, it's done, Adam. It didn't make any sense. So I thought I'd just be honest. End it. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Lou. So proud. Oh. Hello? Shannon. Hi. <laughs> Disaster! My life is a disaster. What's wrong? I burnt my model for the show. You burnt? How? Dry ice. You put dry ice in her hair. That's exactly how the guy in Casualty said it. Like, it's my fault. Casualty? Who knew ice burnt? Doesn't even make sense. <laughs> is she OK? Yeah, she's fine. Mine are burnt. Mm. I'm the one who's screwed. I've got one day till the show. Like, I need a new model. Good luck, baby. Yeah, good luck. Mm. Uh-oh. No way, Bree. <laughs> Why? You just put someone in casualty. So? I made a mistake. Every artist makes mistakes. <laughs> Look, I'll lose the dry ice, Cal. Justin, help me. I think you should do it. Well, what about him? He could do it. No, his hair's too thin. Lacks body. It's really flat, unconvincing. How can hair be unconvincing? Kelly, I'm desperate. Desperate. This is Mark Cannell. It is. It's Mark Cannell, Cal. Cal, please. I so want this. All right, I'll do it. <gasps> yes! <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. It's so amazing. Six months with Mark Cannell in London. London? London. Like, they virtually invented hair. So when would you be leaving? Straight away. I'm well, pretty close to. Mm-hmm. So good, okay, what's up? Are you hearing what I'm saying? Uh-huh. Well, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think a boyfriend's supposed to be excited and caring about what's going on in his girlfriend's life. I do, I am. It's just... I just met you. Go oh, easy, you're in public. Hey. Aren't you engaged? No. No, I'm not. Really? Really. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you like that, do you? Yes. Huh? Makes you happy? Yes. <laughs>